one fourth is smaller than one third. Yes. Because, is that right? That's yes. what you guys said. You said because three people are sharing this, they're going to get a bigger piece. Yes. And if there's four kids sharing this, they're going to get a smaller piece. Yes. All right. So let's see what that might look like on a number line. Yes? Okay. So what number would we put here first? Zero. Zero. Nice. And then what number would go here at the end of our number line? Um, one third. One third? No. One fourth. What, 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 what are we working with here? We're working with a piece a of hole. paper. A hole. How many whole pieces of paper? Um, three. Just one three, whole three thirds. Three thirds. Three thirds. So here's our paper from zero to one. Ready? Okay. Now, what would it look like if we divided that paper into three equal parts? What would go first? What fraction could we write? If we were dividing our paper into three equal parts, what number would go first? Turn and tell your partner. Uh, one, five, yeah. 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 and then yeah. three, three, if we're going to divide our paper into three equal parts. One third. One third. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yes? Yeah. Are you sure? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so one third. What fraction would come next? All right, just tell me, what do you think? Two thirds. Two thirds. And what fraction would come three last? Three thirds. Three thirds. One whole. And three thirds is the same as A number line, right? We did it with the picture. Now let's do the one fourth on top. Let me try a different color. Red. If we were going to yeah. divide this into four equal parts, what fraction would come first? Just stop and think. If we were going to divide our number line into four equal parts, what fraction would come first? Tell a partner. And five. What fraction would come first? What do you think? <coughs> one fourth. What do you guys think? Thumbs up, thumbs yes, down. Yes, yes. Is one fourth bigger than one third or less than one third? Less. Yes. Less than one third. <coughs> Oops, see, let me put it up here. One fourth would go there. All right. What fraction would come next? One. Two, two, four. two fourths. Two fourths. Mm. Is two fourths going to be less than two thirds or greater than two thirds? Less. 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 All right, what fraction would come next? Three fourths. Three fourths. Three fourths. Is three fourths less. greater than one whole or less than one whole? Less. 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 Okay. And what fraction would come last? One whole. One whole. One whole. One whole. What is that? Four fourths. Four fourths is the same as one whole. So now you guys are so good at doing your fractions with a visual model. In the future, I want us to think about <coughs> modeling our fractions on a number line. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So let's look at these parts. On a number line, does it match what we did over here? Yeah. Are the thirds greater than the fourths? Yeah. 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 What would that look like as an equation? <gasps> Which one's larger, one third or one fourth? One, one third. third. Which one is it? One, one third. third. One third, and do you know how to do the greater than, <coughs> less than symbol? Yes. 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 What's the other fraction we were working with? One, one fourth. fourth. Are they equal? No. 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 Which one's greater? One third. One third. One third. Circle it. Circle it. Circle it. Beautiful. Thank you, Matthew.